What's up guys? This is your boy Adiraj Singh. Hope everyone's been having an amazing, amazing day. I thought I'd make a quick vlog here just to kind of show you what my days in quarantine are like. So I recorded this video where I kind of just go through uh, one entire day in quarantine, just kind of showing you what all am I up to. There is a particular reason why I don't want to make it for multiple days because I'm not going to lie pretty much all of the content is going to be very similar because I like to kind of stick to a strict schedule, an entire plan and uh, because that just helps me focus more and just has more coherence in uh, my life as well. Morning guys, it's 8am here in Hong Kong and a bright and sunny day outside. I've just gotten up from my long and restful sleep. It's good to get in about seven to eight hours of sleep on any weekday, to be honest. I thought I'll make a vlog to show you what my day in quarantine life looks like. So, yep, let's go. So the next thing up on my schedule is yoga. Yoga again is uh, something that helps me with calming my mind. I just felt that uh, previously I did not used to do it because I just felt exercise is all I needed. So that's why I used to run in the evenings. But uh, doing yoga in the morning is something that all the gurus and everyone, all the parents and all have said that uh, it is good for the body. It's good for the system as well. Helps with digestion, helps in calming the mind and then just helps you to focus. Uh, which I kind of need throughout the day as well. So that's why I'm, I'm going to be doing about a 15 to 20 minute yoga session and uh, hopefully you guys like it as well. So I just finished with my yoga session there. Um, I feel really rejuvenated, really refreshed. Uh, I would recommend doing yoga early in the morning before you start off your work. Cause I don't know, I just, it, it, it's life changing for sure. And uh, maybe that's just me stuck in quarantine talking, but uh, I, I really like it. Uh, especially if it's just for like 15, 20 minutes as well. So now moving on to the next big thing. Uh, this is one of my favorite things early in the morning, which is gonna be my very first meal. So what it is, is, is it's basically cereal. Uh, I've got my bowl here. Uh, I've got a nice banana that I'm gonna kind of uh, put it up uh, and cut it out as well. And then, um, so I've, I've thrown the box away, but I'm guessing it is a special cake. Uh, for those that are a huge fan before I just used to eat chocos which were my favorite unfortunately the packet's coming to an end uh, but thanks thanks to my friend Nirav who you might see in uh, later videos as well uh, he helped me stock up all my uh, groceries uh, in that sense so let me just get a bit of milk uh, this is carton milk I usually have skim milk because uh, uh, full full toned is something that I don't like much yeah, so that's how the cereal looks like. Uh, I know it's not that appealing, uh, just kind of cutting the banana pieces down and adding a bit of milk. Uh, unfortunately, I am pretty much finishing with all my groceries because uh, it is time uh, to get out of quarantine soon. Uh, but I really like to kind of eat this before I start off my first meeting, which guys so i've just finished off with my morning session of work put in a couple of hours there had two meetings as well and just kind of wrapping up stuff uh, some admin work on that end uh now it's about uh close to one o'clock uh this is when i should be getting my uh lunch um because they give it in like very specific slots that's why i wonder sometimes i feel like i'm in jail because they'll pretty much just bring in the food in these specific slots, knock on your door, and then like all you gotta do is kind of wait it out and open the door and then just kind of get your lunch through as well. So let's see what they've sent across today. They have shared the menu, but I like to keep some excitement because I didn't read out the menu just to see what they have 
to offer as well. So it has to be really quick because there are people outside. I'm not wearing a mask, so I just put my hand outside and just make a quick grab. As you can see, it comes on a seat there. Uh, so just kind of quickly taking it up. It comes in a nice uh, packet by Regal Hotels. Um, right after I pick it up, I do want to wash my hands because I want to make sure uh, hygiene is priority. All right, so after excitingly opening up the packet, uh, what they kind of put in is this box that has the main food, uh, some nice plastic cutlery and a carton drink. Uh, this one is pretty new. Uh, it's called Oolong Tea. It's no sugar. I think it's no fat, nothing at all. The only thing it has is uh, sodium, uh, which I think should be fine and is one of my favorite. Good for digestion, I'm not gonna lie. And that's what they've served. So, smells, smells really good. Looks tasty as well. <laughs> so we've got fish right there in some side, uh, some kind of South Indian curry. We got paneer tikka, we got three pieces of uh, naan and some nice yellow rice. Um, I don't know if that yellow rice is supposed to be really healthy or it's just rice that's been dipped in haldi for some particular reason. Yeah, so I'm, I'm pretty excited about uh, the menu that I've gotten today. I am definitely going to swipe this clean. Uh, what I do usually during my lunch breaks is I kind of take some time off from my laptops, from work as well. So I'll just switch on something on Netflix, uh, watch it while eating my lunch. Many, many minutes later. All right, guys, so I just finished with my work. It's about 6.30 p.m. here now. Um, we, Given that it was a Friday, uh, I had spent some quality time at the end where uh, the team just kind of meets up. We don't talk about work, but it's just like playing some random games just to kind of ease off your mind and look forward to something in uh, and on the weekend as well. So for now, uh, given that I am trying to stick to my schedule, I'm trying to go and do an uh, insane quick workout. Alright guys, that was the end of the workout. I hope you liked it. I can definitely feel my sideburns burning here with all the exercises that we did. As I mentioned, these are about 10 to 15 exercises, 30 seconds each with a good 15 seconds break in between as well. I'm only drenched in sweat, really exhausted. I'm definitely gonna take a rest, hopefully take a bath in the tub and kind of just rest it out in there. So I finished my workout and I just jumped out of the shower there. Uh, I've not dried myself up, uh, so I still need to kind of do that. And uh, unfortunately, yeah, you're gonna see a lot of my backgrounds that are gonna repeat itself, but well, what else can I do? I'm stuck in quarantine and it's gonna be one same room for a really, really long time. <laughs> so after that exhausting and long exercise for about 20 to 30 minutes abs workout, uh, I think I'm gonna move on to my next thing, which is gonna be dinner. That's gonna be the last meal of the day. I hope they've not repeated the menu. So there can be something exciting that I can expect. Right after dinner, I'm gonna jump in bed, kind of put a blanket on and uh, read a couple of chapters of my book before I call it a night. So I just got my dinner and of course it's the same kind of box with the cutlery and the cotton uh, drink there. Um, one thing that's, that I do different is uh, for dinner, I usually don't eat the rice and a couple of the naans uh, because I don't like to eat carbs. But as you can see, we've got naan here, we've got some nice chola. And uh, I'm guessing that is going to be butter chicken. Looks really, really tasty. All right, so that brings me to the end of my day. Day number, okay, I forgot what day it was, but let's just say day, day X. But I hope you guys liked that video, could see how I spend my day in quarantine. Uh, it's definitely that I like to follow a schedule, uh, an entire plan because I just feel more coherent and more focused in that sense. But of course, different people in quarantine have different structures, different life. They might just kind of wing it as well. So what I'm going to do next, of course, before switching off the lights, I'm just going to jump on bed, uh, crank up the Nintendo Switch, play a couple of rounds of Smash Bros, one of the best games ever. You guys got to try it out and then kind of read a couple of chapters of my book before I sleep. And it's it's the weekend tomorrow, so hopefully I can kind of get a more couple of hours of sleep there too. But um, I hope you guys have an amazing Friday. And if you guys like this video, please do make sure to give it a thumbs up and do not, do not forget to subscribe to the channel in the link below. But for now, I'll see you guys later. Bye.
खत्म बाय बाय टाटा गुड बाय